A trailer for an upcoming Lion King movie came out recently, and it's very underwhelming to say the least. Apparently it's a prequel to the original film, where we get to see Mufasa grow up and take part in adventures that the great writers at Disney come up with. The trailer itself shows very little, and is basically like a CGI nature documentary with some extra visuals added to try and hold the audience's attention, similarly to the previous live-action Lion King, which was just a soulless, lifeless remake of the beloved original. We also find out that Mufasa himself had no royal ancestry, which seems to be an attempt from the writer's part to try and make him more relatable to the average Joe. One can only hope that the usual progressive tropes won't be present in this one, and they won't turn him into a non-binary, gender-fluid activist whose life's goal is to be smashing down the patriarchy. Although, it looks like most people don't have very high hopes for it, which is proven by the fact that the trailer has been showered in dislikes at every single place it was posted. But let's see what's actually in it. Okay, right off the bat, this is weird. How did lions get from the savanna into an ice cave? How do they survive there for more than a minute when they're adapted to hot climate and their fur is thus very thin? How do they not starve to death when there is hardly any prey to be found? This story begins far beyond the mountains and the shadows. On the other side of the light. A lion was born without a drop of nobility in his blood. I still don't get why that's important to specifically mention, but I guess we'll have to wait and see. A lion who would change our lives forever. Mufasa. Well, at least they're back in the savannah again, so that's something. The earth will shake. Ugh, never mind. Destiny. As expected, the faces of all the animals are just as expressionless as they were in the remake, even though it seems like they actually tried to fix that this time. Await oh, you. Okay, I guess there will be a lot of jumping in this thing, so if you're into that, you might even like this one. Otherwise, I really don't see how it could be any good. Especially since all so-called live-action remakes, with the exception of the first Lion King's remake, flopped pretty hard for Disney. And I hear their only reliable source of income is currently their theme parks, so they definitely could use a big win in the movie department. Anyway, that's about it for now. Please go ahead and check out this other video I made recently.